Can you guess which actor tied the knot with his husband after dating for 15 years? Which famous couple met in the gym locker room? Exactly who is Sam Smith's talented new man? Let's take a look. Richard Madden and Brandon Flynn. Okay, let's face it, this one was never official, but we have to talk about it because there was so much drama around it. In early to mid-2019, the rumor mill was swirling as Scottish actor Richard Madden was spotted spending a lot of time with openly gay 13 Reasons Why star Brandon Flynn. When he was asked by the press, Madden didn't confirm or deny it. Instead, he was unbothered by the question but in no hurry to answer it. I just keep my personal life personal. I've never talked about my relationships. That definitely wasn't a no. Then, toward the end of last year, it looks like things ended pretty badly. They even lived together, but that soon ended after they had some sort of falling out. No one knows what happened, but it's a shame it ended as these guys were one seriously talented couple. Brandon even told organizers of a Versace event to make sure that Richard wasn't allowed in. If that's not the sign of a bad split, we don't know what is. Sam Smith and Francois Rochi British singer Sam Smith has always been honest about who they are, and that's why we love them. They dated Brandon Flynn, too, a couple of years ago. But after a split, Sam kind of stayed quiet about their love life. Then, in August this year, Smith was pictured smooching their new boyfriend, Francois Rochi. Fans of the singer said they saw the couple looking very loved up while grabbing drinks at a bar. So who is Francois? He's a graduate of the Royal College of Art, so he's obviously got brains as well as looks. He's a product designer, so it's nice to see that they've got that creative streak in common. Smith's songs are nearly always about heartache, so could all that be changing thanks to Francois? Let's hope so. Smith came out as non-binary last year, asking people to call them by the pronouns them, they. Talking to Jamila Jamil, Sam said, When I saw the word non-binary gender queer and I read into it and I heard these people speaking, I was like, that's me. I've always been very free in terms of thinking about my sexuality, so I've just tried to change my thoughts on gender as well. We love to see it. Jesse Tyler Ferguson and Justin Makita Modern Family star Jesse Tyler Ferguson plays a gay character on the show, and he's also gay in real life. The 44-year-old met his husband, Justin Makita, in a really natural, organic way. Talking to Variety in 2020, he said, We're both in the locker room at the gym, fully clothed. I was leaving. I was taken by how handsome he was and how sweet. I started asking questions about him, and I think he was sort of thrown off by that and ran away from me. Luckily, Justin came back. At the time, Jesse was actually in a relationship, but the two reconnected later on when Jesse was single. Now they're one of Hollywood's most solid couples after getting hitched in 2013. They've been together for a whole 10 years. Seriously, can we get some of that luck over here? They welcomed their first child together earlier this year, with Jesse constantly sharing some really adorable pictures of the little one and life as parents. Jim Parsons and Todd Spiewak we fell in love with Jim Parsons as Sheldon on The Big Bang Theory, so when he got married to Tom Spiewak in 2017, we were literally over the moon. 2020 has been such a trashy year, so it's great to see a couple thriving all these years later. Jim and Todd had been together for 15 whole years before eventually deciding to make things official in 2017. When asked by Stephen Colbert why they had waited so long to get hitched, Parsons said, I didn't think we cared that much about the act of it, to be honest. I finally thought, let's have a party, then for the celebration, and we'll go ahead and legalize this thing. It was much more meaningful in the moment to me than I predicted. Jim and Todd don't have any kids and are busy enjoying life to the fullest as one of our most favorite couples in Hollywood. Now, if someone can tell us where we can find a love like that, that would be great. Do you have a favorite LGBTQ couple? Do you have a partner that you just love as much as these guys? Let us know in the comments.